Listen up. One of the things we come to realize about narcissists is they love to romanticize. See, God does not romanticize. I, I need y'all to understand that. You know, so did you hear Jesus, right, trying to romanticize anybody? No. When you read the Word of God and you hear us preach the Word of God, there's no romanticizing. I mean, Jeremiah 1 5, right? Yeah, he says, Before I formed thee in the womb, I knew thee. I sanctified thee, set us apart. I, yes, I ordained thee a prophet unto the nation. There's nothing romantic about that. And then when Jesus, you know, teaching God's spiritual truths, speaking truth, and he would ask, why do ye not understand my speech? Oh, he knew. But that's not romantic. Every time Jesus would talk about how it's like the Father is in me and I in the Father, that's not romantic. So they didn't romanticize nothing. But narcissists, watch out for that, y'all, because that is a big, big, big red flag. Okay, now how do you know if it's... Well, think about the... Come on now. Think about the love bombing. That's all romanticizing. Think about it. Future faking. That's all romanticizing. Yeah. So watch out for that. It's a huge red flag. Romanticizing is a big, big, big red flag. And the Jezebel case study... Oh my gosh. Of course she did. Let me share with you all a quick story. I put together a local event where I used to live at a flea market and I needed, right, I was going to have to get some help to put up the tent. Well, long story short, she decided to hop a plane and come on out to help me with the local event advertising the ministry. So we get the tent put up and that's fine and nice. It was a little bit windy. And so, while I went to the restroom, she decided to stage a little event, if you will, and make it look as though it was God. Doesn't mean that it wasn't. But, because the wind was blowing one corner of the tent, she put some dirt over it and, and, a, and a brick and I looked over and I said hey I said who put that there she was like I don't have any idea she played it off next thing I know in the mail I get this photo beautifully framed and then some you know a black and white photo of that particular thing because she was saying you know how wonderful that you know God did that for us that was romanticizing. Oh, it went in the trash, y'all. It went in the trash. So, anyhow, don't ignore that. If you can sense when somebody's trying to romanticize you, it's like they're trying to tug at your heartstrings. They're trying to woo you. Alright? That's a big red flag. And that's a narcissist. It could chose the ones. We don't do that. We don't feel the need to do that. Oh... Life is not a Hallmark movie. Wakey, wakey, folks. Spiritual battle for the mind is a real thing. Sending love and light always.